Hey everybody, welcome back to another open chart tutorial. In today's video, we're going to be learning how to place a watermark over your footage. So to do this, you require to have two different files. So over here, what we have is my base footage. And over here, what we have is my um, watermark that I'm going to place on top of this particular video over here. Now, this video is from a video uh, tutorial based on OpenShot where we went over how to kind of grade or kind of correct a video. If you haven't checked that out, feel free to do so. With that out of the way, first you have to make sure that your um, clip is placed. I mean, you would need to have two different tracks for this, but OpenShot gives you five different tracks. Um, by default so you don't really need to worry about inserting or removing a track however if you want to do it you can just click this little arrow over here and either uh, choose one of these two options which is add track above or add track below but as i said and we don't really need to uh, do something like that uh, for now so we can just get on with the video next we'll have to place your uh, watermark on top of the video so your watermark comes above your base footage uh, because these kind of work like uh, layers, right? So the one on top is visible over the one on the bottom. So your watermark goes on top, your video goes under the watermark. I hope I'm making sense over here. Next, once you've put the watermark, we really need this watermark to last for the entirety of the video. And to do something like that, uh, we'd have to just drag and make sure it aligns uh, right over here. Once that's done, Next, what we have to do is adjust this particular image over here so that it really looks nice and really looks like a watermark. So over here, we've got the Geekrid uh, logo that I'm going to place as a watermark. Uh, and to mess around with this, you'd have to right click um, on your uh, watermark and choose the properties. You could also hit Ctrl I and the same thing would uh, pop up on the left side over here. The values that we want to be taking a look at over here is gravity, uh, location X, location Y, uh, skin X and skin Y. Now these are the things that are going to be playing the most important role in uh, transforming your watermark uh, which is a fancy way of saying uh, adjusting and resizing your watermark. So first we're going to play around with um, the skin because first of all watermarks are definitely smaller in size. So you just want to double click over here and you can put in whatever value. I'm going to put 0 0.20 uh, you can already see it's getting distorted so that's why as soon as you put the value make sure you put the same value for the skin x just like that you can see uh for my taste this is incredibly small uh so i'm just gonna make this a little more big there we have it and uh, now this is at a much more better size and uh, next we, we could either play with the location x and location y uh, you can drag this like that and you can see it's moving there on the, on the right side and the same thing applies for the y axis as well uh, you can drag it and it's going to move just like that um, but um, we can go ahead and just uh, reset this by just hitting zero because what we can do is much more faster you can just right click over here on gravity and that gives you all of these options and you can choose one of these preset um, options so this is usually uh, the most used options and OpenShot was really kind enough to provide them by default so you don't really have to mess around with the location and uh, location x and y axes so what we're going to be doing is i like to put my watermarks on the top corners or the bottom corners and i prefer the bottom right or left i'm going to place it in the bottom left and you can already see that it's placed over here now this is an idea obviously uh so what you could do is you could play with the location x and location y values again or you could just um hold it with your mouse and you can sort of drag this uh so you can sort of position itself uh right where you want it to just like that so there you have it that is how you can put a watermark on your videos in open shot i really hope this video helped you out and if it did do feel free to like and subscribe and share this particular video with all your friends who you think might benefit from this that being said and catch you guys in the next one Bye bye